Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today is going to be another small project sh share for Scrap Diva Designs. Um, this is the website where you can go pick up some of these dies if you are so inclined to do. And then here is all of Erica's social media so you can follow along at different on different platforms. Okay. Um, here we go. The two dies I'm featuring today are these two, which is called the hibiscus flower plate. So you get the two plates that have two different sizes. So there's a larger one and a smaller one. Okay. And then each plate has the flowers and the centers and then whatever this thing is called. I don't know what that's called on a hibiscus flower. And then there's some circles here too. Um, so each of them has three sets of that size. Okay, so it makes it super easy to cut those out. And you can get all kinds of different looks um, using the different plates and the different ways you put it together. So I'm going to show you some of that here in a second. The second die set that I'm featuring is this one, which is called the Tropical Leaves. I love it. You get so many different shapes. So you get this shape. This is just uh, a one shape because it's just kind of straight up. This one also because it's just a straight on um, flower. And this design here is just one. And then this one here is one. And this one. So all the ones that are curved though, I guess is what I'm trying to say, is you get two. So like these two here are curved to one way or the other. So you get the one direction and then you get it curved the other direction. And then same with this one. You get this one that's curved to the left and this one that's curved to the right. So super handy. And I love all the different styles of the flowers that she included in this kit. So it gives you lots of options how you want to put it together. So well, that one's called the um, Tropical Leaf Set. So highly recommend that set. Okay, so I made some of the um, flowers and combined them with the tropical leaves. So you can get some really cute um, combinations. So you can see I did all different kinds. So I got this kind of just pokey type one right here. I got that one here and then one of these straight bigger leaves up here some I did the same colors, some I did two different colors of green. Um, all my flowers, I cut out the flowers in a lighter shade and then the centers um, in a darker shade. It's hard to tell on this one because I didn't, the two papers that I had were real close in color. So the center is a little bit darker, but it's really <laughs> a little bit harder to tell on this one. I should have inked them so that um, you could see more of the definition, but I didn't. So this one, I put like two of these um, together that was the same um, shape, but like I say, how they were um, shaped, you know, pointing the different directions. Okay. These ones that I put together here are all using um, two, two layers of the flowers. Okay. These are all using two. Um, let's see. I think I, where's that one I did? I had one where I only, oh yeah. So uh, this one, I didn't put any flowers and this one I just did one layer, okay? So you can get all kinds of different looks. And this one, I didn't do any leaves. It's just got the same center and then the little um, dot there in the center. So you can get that look also, okay? And then, let's see, here's another one of the layered with the leaves, okay? And then I also did a bunch, these are also two layers, but without the leaves, okay, or the centers or anything else. So it's a pretty flower this way also. So you can stack it up however you want. So these ones, let's see, I think, like these, ha this one here has two of the same big ones. This one has a, the big one and small one. Um, these ones have a big one and a small one. These two have a big layer, the, the larger layer than the smaller layer. Um, so you can see all the different looks that you can get. Color combinations. 
also a super pretty flower, even if you say, oh, I don't use tropical flowers. Well, this, like this, does not look like a tropical flower to me, anyway. So you can make it, you know, look however you want to look, however you want to look, make it look. So, and then just a plain flat one with just one layer. So tons of options. So I just wanted to share that with you. Um, I think they turned out really pretty and um, they I used um, card stocks that match the collection that I'm working with right now for these summer projects is the um, Simple Stories uh, Just Beachy. So it matches really well. So anyway, just wanted to share that with you. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, I will be sure to um, link Erica's website. I will list my discount code if you decide to pick up anything, and I will also list uh, link these dies. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.